the section heading is called verifying the control works. So the way that the control is basically configured inside of our index.php file is it basically set up to disallow the input element from rendering and displaying an input field. So what we're going to do in this section is we're going to verify that that is the case. So we're going to come over here and again we're going to define our query parameter where we're defining the variable to be the input element. Now when we execute this we're going to find that the control works. So we no longer see that input field being displayed. So if we right click and view the page source, we're going to see the same exact characters that we see being displayed on the web page. Now in HTML, plain text is plain text, and essentially that's what this is being interpreted as. So it's not following the complete syntax or command structure as far as for the element meaning like the full complete you know tag and content and everything else in between and that is what's disallowing that input field from being displayed because it's not complete so here's what you're going to do for your pen testing assignment your pen testing assignment is basically going to be to bypass the control and allow this input element to display an input field 